My name is Thais Brightflower Gold Jacinto, and I'm from the Nanticoke Lenny Lenape tribe. And in this video, I'm going to show you the beginning stages of the pine needle basket art. Now that we have all of our materials, we're ready to begin. And just take a good handful and place them on your towel. Measure out your piece of sinew. As I measure it on the length of my arm, going up to my shoulder, and double it. We're going to split this sinew in half. Okay, you just want to put this one piece aside. One end goes on your needle. And now we're ready. We don't knot the end. The next step, since we're going to make this, we're going to take the ends off of the pine needles like so. You just give it a little tug and the end comes off. Let's see. I like to work with bundles of six. So we're going to do this six times. I like to even it up, make sure that it's very even. Now you're gonna take the end of your sinew. <clears throat> you're gonna make a loop, like so. Okay. Approximately a half an inch into the pine needles. Make the loop and you wrap. And you take your needle go through the loop Do you see the tail of the string, the sinew? You pull that. And it makes it secure. Then trim the tail and any pine needles that are sticking out. Now your bundles are secure and ready for weaving. And this is going to be your starting point. The next step is to bend the bundle of pine needles. 
And now it's parallel with the beginning stage. You have your pointing, you have your, you turn it and you insert the needle, securing the turn. You're going to wrap it around again. And this time you're going to go through the sinew. What you're doing is you're starting the middle. You can wrap it again and go through the sinew. Turn your pine needles again, wrap them around the beginning. So now you have stitch work, you have your center, and now it's wrapped on the other side. Take your sinew, go around to the other side. and then insert it in the center. You're still working on the center. And do it again. You can adjust the stitches so they're not so close together. And wrap it, insert the needle into the center. Wrap your pine needles around your work. Pull your sinew around again. Insert the needle into the center. We have one complete turn around the center of the basket. You wrap your pine needles. Your next step is to go next to the previous stitch. And 
inside the bundle. This is what's gonna create the pattern. Insert the needle next to the previous stitch. And now the work becomes easier. Once we get past the beginning stages, insert the needle next to the previous stitch. ready for a turn. Now, when you don't have a stitch and you see a wide turn, you merely sew it down. That begins the next for the next row 